Hello everyone. In this video session, I'm going to explain part 156 of Java for Tester series, that is multi-level inheritance. So in Java, there are different types of inheritance. There are different types of inheritance in Java. They are single inheritance, multiple inheritance, multi-level inheritance, hierarchical inheritance, then hybrid inheritance. Like this, there are different types of inheritance we have in Java. And the current video session, I am going to explain the third type of inheritance that is multi-level inheritance. So what is this multi-level inheritance? What is this multi-level inheritance? So if I have to diagrammatically represent this multi-level inheritance, it will look something like this. Let's say this is class A, then we have class B, then we have class C, okay? Like this, there are different classes. Here, class B is inheriting the properties from class A. That is class B is extending the class A. And class C is inheriting the properties from class B. That is class C is extending class B, okay? Is this possible, guys? Is this kind of inheritance type possible with classes in Java? Is multi-level type of inheritance possible with classes in Java? The answer is yes, it's possible. Okay, this kind of inheritance type is possible, guys. So let me practically demonstrate how this can be possible. Okay, so in this Java project, let's create a new class, say class A. Okay, and in this class A, let's create some properties, say int x. Some sample properties I will create that is variables and methods, public void, method x, let's say. Okay, now. I'll create another class. I'll call this class as class B. And here in class B also, I'll move it to a different view so that you can see all the classes together. Okay. Class A and class B, you can see it together. Same time. So here I will say int y, public void, method y. I just created few properties inside the class B also. Now I'll create another class that is class C. Click on finish. Class C got created. I'll move here so that you can see all the three classes, class A, class B, class C at the same time. Now guys, what I want to do here is, here I want this class B to extend class A. Here you see class B is extending class A, right? Let's make that possible. Class B extends class A. You see, it's possible. Now guys, I want to, make this class C extend this class B, which is extending this class A, okay, like this. Extends class B. You see, this is also possible, guys, okay? In Java, we can have multiple classes, okay, where one class is extending another class and other class is extending the other class, like this, okay? This kind of chain. Class B is a child class of the class A because class B is extending class A, and class C is a child class of the class B because class is extending class B. So this is how guys, multi-level inheritance, okay? Multi-level inheritance is possible in Java. I'm not getting any compiler errors, guys. Here I can successfully make one class, a child class of other, and that class, a parent of another class, okay? Class C extending class B, class B extending class A like that, okay? A chain, a multi-level kind of representation can be implemented in Java, guys. Fine. So, so this is all about the multi-level inheritance, guys, where one class extends from another class and uh, which, which actually extends another class, okay? So that is possible in Java as we didn't get any compiler error. In the next video session, I'll explain the next type of inheritance that is hierarchical inheritance. I'll practically demonstrate how to implement this hierarchical in inheritance in the next video session, guys. So that's it, guys. See you in the next video session. Thank you. Bye.